you could tell that uh, he demanded a certain level of respect and he had leadership abilities that were necessary for that offense when you look at obviously some of the personalities and <laughs> maybe even egos you know on that offense just so many great players but certainly so many guys that uh, you know um, were involved in the offense and, and, and wanted their touches, needed their touches. And so uh, just watching the way that he, you know, was able to kind of lead that offense and manage the game and make big plays when he needed to, you know, made some big throws and some big situations. And listen, it's hard to win three championships in four years. Um, you know, very few have done that. And so that's, uh, that's an impressive feat and certainly one that, you know, I think we all would love to, to be able to match. The things he always talked about with Troy that he tried to emphasize to me were, um, you know, number one, just some of the, the mechanics were, you know, that quick, the quick feet, your ability to get to a certain depth and then be in a position to throw, um, getting the ball out on time, uh, a quick release, being compact. Probably the biggest thing he, he talked about with Troy was his fiery, competitive nature, you know, on the practice field and on game day. Um, the guy had a will to win, a desire to win, and um, certainly that's where a lot of his leadership ability came into play where, you know, he was going to demand a lot from his team, but, but he was going to give that in return as well.